Right, eventually I'm up in a Derbyshire Dales. Derbyshire. <laughs> Derbyshire. How would you say it? Derbyshire. Dab. At last, I'm up in the Derbyshire Dales <laughs> and guess. <laughs> Hang on. Right. Right, I'm out again in the Derbyshire Dales, the green, green hills, and guess who we've bumped into? Oh, well, has welcomed me here with a nice bacon butty. Have a nice bacon cob. Yeah, muffin. So, yeah, I've just had that, and uh, weather's wet. brightened up. Weather's brightened up a bit. I'm hopefully. You promised with lad, haven't you? Spindle Whirl. Spindle Whirl. That's on the uh, to-do list today. And I'm not going all until I get one. Fair enough. Right. See you on the next one. <laughs> right, first real signal here. I've had a 20p. Looks like a brass bell. Yeah, Gaz is well after this, you see. He likes a good bell, don't you, Gaz? Uh, so, yeah, I think he had a bit of string on there. Ding dong. Right. Let's get some lead. Right, we've got the uh, Duke of Derbyshire here on me right. <laughs> He's come over to check out this gold coin that's going to pop out because it gives me a mid at 50 threes. It's a gold ring. It you could well be. You get noble MDT over the back of your head. It could well be. What would you actually do? <laughs> <laughs> I'd be happy for you, mate. Let's have a look. Uh, I've had my gold for the year. Oh, I know you have. I know you bloody have. Oh, it's not looking good, though, guys. It's not looking good. It's it's big and it's bulky, whatever it is. Can't seem to find it, mate. Oh, have I got lead? Lead from the Der Derbyshire. <laughs> lead from the Derbyshire Dales, and it's just a flat piece of lead. I'd normally go for a palm guard, but I'm, it's not. It's scrap, man. Yeah. It's actually folded, there's no, there's no curse in it, so we're all right. All right, moving on. Right, I've decided to join Gaz and find a, a nice decimal, pre-decimal coin here. Look at the colour of that. Oh, I think it's going to be a bit tired of you. 1861, a bit crusty on that side. Oh, it's come up all right, yeah. So I'm on the coins at last, and it was a decent depth that on all. Six, seven, eight, nine. Say about nine inches. All right. Move on. Your eighties, nice and clean. Let's give it a liven. Guys is over there doing a bit of filming. Some trees or something. I wouldn't mind a nice piece of silver to uh, cheer Gaz up a bit. Derbyshire silver. Oh, it is. That is a coin. It's a toasted one at that. I don't think we'll get anything off that, guys. That's well cut. There's Dukes of Derbyshire there, can you see him? It's a lovely footage of the wildlife and the nature. He's doing his thing. We've got lead. You're on the dandies. The posh buttons them, aren't they? Yeah. But I've got a big hunk of lead here. Just a hunk of lead, that's it. Maybe it's, it used to be a spindle wheel, that, what? Have you got to say it, a hole through it? <laughs> oh, I could put a hole through it, though. <laughs> right. Medieval silver. I'm a groat. What do you say, Baba? That is a very, very cool coin. What an hammer that was. We were just talking about hammers and all. About how long it's been and all that lot. Now, the, the signal was, it was only wispy. Pretty crappy signal, but what an hammer. Huge. And a buckle. Guys, he's on buckles. I am on a trade weight. And it has got, it has got markings on it, this. Might be Charles. 
It's got like a sword on it. This is old, this. This is old. Those trade ways look looking nice, mate. I've only ever found... Oh, it's nice, this, mate. It's nice. So there we are. I will find out... Mate, that's a big one, ...what it could be. There's four markings on there. Georgian. You see yeah, this mark in there? Well, mate. I've got a couple of them at home in my cupboard. I don't know if that's, is that a crucifix or a sword? I'm sure the sword's come up as Charles. But I, I won't know just off the bat it's here now. It's in condition as well. Yeah, no, yeah, I'll give that a proper clean. Right, best find yet. Right, nice little patch of land this, right in front of the farmhouse. There's uh, quite a bit coming up now. I've got an old Martina Henry bullet. Yeah, they're a lot longer. Lead. I'm sure they're lead. Lead. Not even with the grass, that. Okay. <laughs> Bigger than a quid, so I'm gonna say it's an old penny. But it also could be. Oh, yeah, look. You see, it changed colour there, can't you? Wow, look at the colour of that. George V, big old penny. Okay, when it comes up that half age. That's a little bit of imprint on there, look for you. For all the doubters out there. Hey, you're planting them! <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I'm happy with that. Can't go anywhere without finding one of them. No, we're just working down this tree line over the top and I'll work back down to the, the path there where Gaz is going and I just had another piece of lead but it's a bit of shapes lead and it's got something going on it that right, I'll give that a bit of a clean up and we'll see what that is it's interesting some initials on it maybe right, so there we have it is it? I'm not too sure. I'll ask Gaz in a bit. Because uh, he knows his lead. He's got a right uh, display of lead. I've just seen today. So, you may be a farmer's soaker. Wow, the sun's started to come out. It's so stuffy. I'm uh, sweating cobs. But I've got another signal here. It come up 72s. Just there. Let's see what it is. Let's see what it is. Oh, wow. Look at this. Oh, that's lovely. Let's give that a spray. Obviously, war period. Well, I'm thinking so. It'll probably have. Oh, I like that. Yeah, so it says born 1819. Crowned 1838, so that'll be Queen Victoria. It's nice that it's got actually got a hole in the top there where it was hung and it's a jubilee. Yeah, it worked wrong, guys, about the lead. There's so much lead, they must have had a, a couple of key eats of lead. So, yeah, it spends in it, we'll get it weighed in and that. So we're gonna work our way down. It's just so stifling. It's so stifling that. There's no air, if you know what I mean. Oh yeah, let's go on to the next. 
Guys nearly had a butterfly on cam then. He was a bit camera shy. But what about I've pulled up here? So much to do with the navy. And it's gold on the back. So yeah, I'll put that in the foam nail. Uh, gold found. <laughs> okay. You've got that butterfly yet? Yeah? Right, so well and truly. Knacker, it's been knackering, hasn't it? Really hard work. Sweating back out and that, but yeah, it's, it's been good. Considering it's bloody October, it's been very, very warm. Oh, hilly, sweaty. But it's been good, it's been good. I've got to a couple of bucket listers there and all, which I'm really happy about. I didn't get me a uh, spindle. spindle whirl, but I did get some nice lead bits, which I'm happy about and that, yeah. It's been great, and I saw Gaz. Shoot some derbies to get you hammered. Yeah. Lovely, wasn't it? A very rare time for me to find a hammer, so I'm, I'm happy with moaning for six months, I've not found one. There you go. All good in the hood. I just wish it were me. Anyway, <laughs> nice one, guys. See you on next.